Hey friends, we are heading in to Sam's Club for our monthly stock up haul. So it is February. Their coupon book was looking pretty stellar. So I compared between Costco and Sam's and I thought Sam's was the place to go this month. So if you are ready to stock up for your monthly groceries, if you're looking for some good sales, some good bargains, I'm going to take you in here, show you some new finds, share with you the prices, and we will do a haul when we get home. So let's do some in-store shopping at Sam's and then we'll head on home and I'll show you what we got. All right, let's see what they got. It is a beautiful 50, it's gonna be 55 degrees here in Chicago today. Our weather has been spring-like and we don't know how to act, so. And it's also Super Bowl weekend. So let's go see if we can get some fun snacks for the big game. All right, this rug is new and I really like this. I was just telling him this is really pretty. They do have the four piece modular sectional still for a thousand. I love this. I want a modular sectional because I can kind of set it up to fit my living room space. This one's really, really nice. I just feel like these cushions are gonna come off when the kids like flop around. Cause you know how kids are, right? They flop around on everything. But anyways, they have that and keep on walking. They have a lot of nice area rugs and I think they're 200, which for whatever reason, rugs are super expensive. This is really nice too. I like the color. It's like a heathered gray, very pretty, but my kids and my dog will mess it up and it's a little too small, but I really do like that. And then they have a dinette set here, which is really nice for 900, but we actually just got us. All right, here are these rugs are. They are indoor, outdoor, eight by 10, $90, which is a good deal. Like I said, for whatever reason, rugs are super expensive. And they have these patterns. And then yeah, these is really pretty. This one's nice too. Oh, I just got a new area rug. I always get mine from um, boutique rugs. I love them, they're super thick, but Here's another one. This one's 138 by 10. Again, really, really nice. They do have their outdoor stuff out here. We need some new planters. Um, the ones I have are old and I feel like they, I'm gonna have to put like a stand underneath them because last year one of my hibiscus is just rotted. And I think it's because it's not draining, but I really wanna get some nice ones because I have three like big planters I keep out front and I like for them to match, so. These are nice, so they're really pretty. I actually, these are the ones I really like. I wanna put something like this in my back patio because we do like tropical plants. These are 40, but these ones are, these two are 15 and those two are 20. These are 40, but Leo was saying that they're not, they have like, it's only, you only have to put like that much dirt in them. So it's really nice. They have them in the gray and in the black. They have the XXL deck boxes. We actually have a deck box but not the XXL one, like just the regular size. They're really nice to have because you we use ours for the same reason to store like our patio for our patio cushions, but we also can sit on them. Like people sit on them when we have parties. This one's 190. Um, they have one that looks like a bench, which I think would be really nice as well. Um, if you have like uh, maybe like a patio or whatever and you want to keep like your pool floaties, I think that would be a really good idea. But this is, is this like 50? Mm -hmm. No. The trash can. Oh, the trash can. And then this one, I don't see a price on that one. Um, they have the outdoor waste bin for 50. My mom has those. She uses it, she has two of them on her patio and she, she, uses for the floaties, right? she uses those for the floaties, yeah, because she never puts a deck. She doesn't like for people to put garbage up there because she always forgets. She's always that she's gonna forget and it's gonna get gross up there. But a lot of nice selections here. So I don't know if your kids still do like Easter dresses or maybe have something parties going on, but they have this one. It goes up to from a size four to 16. I would buy one for Becky. I liked this one for Becky. It's like a tiered one. They're only $18 and they have like those pretty green. They're even getting their bathing suits in, but <sighs> Becky's at that age where Leo's right. I have to bring her with me and yeah, that sucks. But they have these glass storage, 20 bucks. Yeah, these glass storage sets, $24. Maybe I should get one of these. These are like what we have for your lunches and everything and we lost a bunch of them. It's 20 bucks for all of those, for 24 pieces. But, I don't know, do we need something like that? No, because we end up, end up half of it ends up lost. You're right, okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. we got to put all of our business out there. Mm -hmm. I don't know what, this is on clearance, a Ninja Speedy a rapid cooker and air fryer for 83. Hmm. And then here is their crock pot for 80. This is very, very nice. And then they also have their air fryer for 160. 
I feel like it's all kind of the same prices everywhere you go. If you want a Belgian waffle maker, they have that for 30 All right, if you're a charcuterie person, this is a really cute idea, or even for a gift. These are only $17.38, and there's two of them. And they have them hanging. These are really nice. This is like my basket, but better. I think this is actually way taller than my basket. I don't think it'll fit. Yeah, I don't think it would fit either. That's what it looks like, but it's 40. That's really nice. Though. They have Yellowstone pillows. My dad loves Yellowstone. 1060 and I think they even have blankets yeah that's kind of cool so if you guys like that um I was looking at this I want to show you guys it's a two-in-one lounge mat plush removable cover that is machine washable for $83 it's huge though it's like a twin bed that's a, that's a overpriced sleeping bag but it's a pillow though too they lay on it. it's not the ground my nephew's birthday's coming and TT always likes to get the best gifts you okay? left us but this is your reminder if you guys do not have it get the app get the app download it everything before you get here because you really get a good <gasps> they have throw blankets Leo walked away so look at these $10 do we need one I feel like I need one for my bedroom oh my god why are you so close to me hold on sorry about that but they have like Christmas ones these nice thick ones but I'm thinking something like this for my room would be nice I don't need it. I don't need it. Get, get me out of here. This is why I don't come down this aisle. I think this is a really great deal. This is the Easy Ring Mop System. I actually have this one. It's $41.98, which I believe it's $40 at Target. But what I thought was a really good deal is it comes with three extra mop heads, which is a really good... I think those are $10 each. So you're, they would have been $40 for this and then you know another $30 bucks just for the extra mop heads. So you're basically buying the bucket and the mop set and then getting three mop heads for free. I think that's a really good deal. And I, I really do like this mop. Um, keeps the floors from getting real like sloppy wet and all that stuff. So I really do like it. I think it's a really good mop to use. I have hardwood floors and I've been using it forever. I clean my floorboards with it. I clean my walls with it. It's a great mop. Um, definitely worth the hype. I think this, I'm gonna put this out here. My next, once we do our next thing with the house, um, I'm definitely going to try to see if when we like reconfigure the kitchen, I want to put a dishwasher in because I'm tired of having dish pan hands. And I know people are going to talk shit about these paper plates, but you know what? Come wash the dishes, okay? Come wash the dishes. I love getting like the after school or the school lunch snacks or like even their little snacks for my kids from here. Um, they have like pop tarts and stuff. Like sometimes my kids like them. Some I love pop tarts, honey. But I don't need to be. I can't be trusted. I think I might get some of these because the kids like these. I like to have like a little bit of a variety. And my biggest trick, honey, is I keep all of this stuff in my room, and I pack my kids' lunches because these last us forever. Like we still have some of like their like gummies that I bought from here like two months ago. And they're, I mean they're still good. Um, they're individually sealed, but. Once I keep like that out of like the general thing, or even when their friends come over, I'm like, all right, I'll bring out the box and you guys can grab a snack from there. But I don't keep them at hand for them because they last longer and they're not snacking all the time. So um, they have some really good snack options right now. So I'm probably gonna stock up a little bit just because they are on sale. And then, um, you know, they can, you know, I don't have to buy them. This again. is a new find, sorry, baby. They have the poppies. I don't know how much the poppies are, but they have these Alani's Cherry Twist. Those are $17.98. So if you guys like those, I feel like they do have a lot of energy drinks here. They have a lot of nice drink choices. But let me ask you guys, do you feel like... Oh yeah, sorry. Um, I thought something was really expensive. But um, do you feel like drinks have gone up a lot? Okay, here's another one. Cinnamon Toast Latte cans. They're like coffee, iced coffee mix. 100 calories for one can. Okay, look at Hear me out. These do have a lot of sugar in them, right? But... They are controlled. Cinnamon toast iced coffee. This is $12.48 with scan and go. So it's less than you know a dollar per can. And at least you know exactly what the macros are. So you're not you know getting away from you. I mean I wouldn't drink it, but some people like I don't know if you guys have tried these, the crispy honey honey biscuits. I think we're gonna get those. They also have would you like to try these? These are no, okay. Uh, ciabatta with whole grain, egg whites, turkey sausage, and cheese. Yeah, <laughs> but you want the crispy chicken honey biscuits? Yes. Say less. Those, those, they do look a scrumptious. Hold on, let me pull up my app. Also, guys, make sure you get this app because 
you get really good deals off of certain items if you use the app. Like I got the fragrance pe pebbles for my laundry and they're on sale for 15, but with the app they're only 11. Um, I'm gonna get these, all oh, these are chicken strips. You think the kids will eat them? Lightly breaded, I'm gonna do those. Lightly breaded, look, they can go for some lightly breaded. Can they make them in the, that's real chicken, right? It's only three pounds. In the dairy aisle, they have a lot of stuff on sale. Our cart is full. I need to get some stuff for whatever reason. Let me know if your kids school the same. They are off a crap ton of days this year, this month. So, and they're having Galentines and stuff. So anyways, um, I'm trying to do some stocking up on certain items like cream cheese because I've been doing a lot of different, I'm gonna do some dips and stuff like that and I need it and it's super cheap to get it this way. Um, yeah, so I think I'm gonna do that. Uh, definitely take a peek. Too. Yeah, I know. I don't know if I want to do both though. That's, I'd rather just get one little one. But yeah, cream cheese. Toss it in. Heavy whipping cream. That's what four sixty eight is a really good deal for that heavy whipping cream. That stuff's expensive. Five seventy eight for the two things of orange juice. My kids love orange juice. They'll finish that whole thing in one day. Look at that. Six ninety seven for the simple orange. That's a good deal. Yeah, for sure. Good deal. All right, so looking at what they have, they have the uh, salmon that's $3 off the package. They have it with the sockeye salmon and then the other one as well. Yeah, and they're $3 off. The only reason I am not going to get it is because I'm the only one who eats the salmon and it's such big pieces. I mean, I could probably cut them up and divide them. Which maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll get a packet. The only thing is, is I could try to find like a small packet to justify like it only being me like they're all they're like they're just too big so sometimes for me it's just cheaper essentially to go to um what do you call that to like a, a local grocery market and then just buy like one or two pieces because it's just for me for one meal a day you know all right we are gonna get some of these these are the ribeye steak sliders um leo makes them on the grill on the flat top and they come out so freaking good and highly recommend they are delicious they're having a really great deal their lobster tails are on sale um we also take a peek and we look for okay chicken wings right now you can see they're all marked down we can probably get some of these the kids love them um these would be good for sunday mm -hmm. you want to there's two 13 dollar packs i think we actually have a pack well, there's downstairs. One downstairs so we'll just get one okay so um we always come on wednesdays to do our shopping and this is where we kind of have the best luck with trying to get you know watch stuff marked down so definitely recommend you know checking out that way i don't know why it's wednesday but you know whatever i don't know it's every other day of the week but we do pretty good no it's usually just kind of the luck of the uh, uh, these are the boneless these are just the fresh ones right yeah uh, i like the packs i think well how much are these a pound 348 348 the same price as the yellow ones. oh is it yeah we'll get the other ones if you like the green, the Greek, uh, the ground turkey, they have that here. My mom loves it. I just, I cannot, I cannot. Um, they have ground pork. The ground pork is two sixty six a pound. That's a good deal. Um, I like to do my egg rolls with ground pork. That'd be a really good snack to make for Super Bowl PS. They're really easy. Just get some cabbage, some ground pork, um, a little bit of soy sauce. I mean, and then you get those little. Um, rolls like the the papers i forget what they're called i think they're called a roll wraps at like your market and do them throw them in the air fryer fire um they have ground beef ragu that is 588 a pound i usually get this uh ground beef the 93 percent lean but i have a ton of that at home so i'm not gonna buy that this time um this is what they use to do like the multiple meals with um 90 lean this is 940, 983 a pound, I guess, or no, it's 960 a pound, not 398 a pound. I'm sorry, and I know it's 40 bucks, but you can get a ton of meals out of that. So that's where you see a lot of people doing on TikTok where they do like the meat challenge from Sam's Club. That's what they do. Okay, I know that this is all the rage right now on social media. This Bloom brand, I've never tried it. I use the one from One Up, which I love. If you guys want to try it, I have like a link down below. It's just 30 dollars. It has a eight dollar rebate or eight dollar off. It's usually $37.98, so you guys want to check that out. Let's see what else they have. They have quite a few good deals going on. Um, let's see. Mouthwash. Oh, look at Crest came out with its own like whitening system. I wonder how legit that is. I think we need toothpaste. 
I don't remember. No, I think I just opened one, so I think we're actually good. Anyways, let's let's peruse this aisle and see what they got. I'm gonna tell you this, the Fairlife chocolate protein shakes are probably the best tasting protein shake I've ever had. They're 20 bucks, so good. They literally taste like a chocolate milk. The only reason I don't do them is I'm pretty much dairy free and also they have that carrageenan in it and that messes up my stomach. But if you're okay with that, honey, try it because they are scrumptious. And if you're struggling to get protein, 30 grams, it's fire. They have built bars here, $21. I think these are the puff ones. And they have the Quest peanut butter cups. Those are 25. They have like different premier proteins. That's usually the ones when I would have a pre-made one. I use one from 1UP. Cinnamon roll, they have chocolate. And then they have this one, which is what? Salted caramel popcorn. That's kind of weird. I don't know if any of you guys do like crickets or anything like that, but they have these Easy Weed heat transfer vinyls. These, this like big three pack of all of them. And they have like different colors too for $19.97. And then this is also like a really nice two piece puzzle. And it's like the wood puzzles for kids. $12.98. It's really cute. I really do like just looking through their clothing section. They have a lot of cute like men's sweatshirts and stuff. It's different bands Guinness, the Rolling Stones, Jimi Hendrix. $16.98. They have these Gap Oxford button up shirts which are really nice kind of similar to the one I'm wearing today um, these are actually a little bit softer though these are $17.98 which is a really nice deal and then let's see shirt jackets this is the lucky brand oh oh they're shackets those are nice and they have these really nice hoodies too for $13.98 I usually just try to pick up stuff for Leo because he usually fights me on it but also, if you guys are book people, they have a great selection of books. Um, I recently, I am on, uh, what is that called? The Court, or Crescent City. I'm reading Crescent City, the first one. I'm actually listening to it on Audible. Oh, God, it's so good. It's so good. It's taking me forever. Just so freaking good. If you guys, I'll, if, you, if you guys want to talk about it, let me know. This car, this cart is packed, okay? We got a lot of good stuff, though. A lot of stuff for the kids. A lot of stuff for our, um... We got a lot of meats, stuff I need for around the house. Yes, so grand total, can you guys think of it? This is what I do like about the app is, let me just show you, you have no surprises. So if you're working on a budget, baby, it tells you right there how much you're working with. So, all right, get out of here. Don't worry about it, Leo, you're not paying for it. All right, let's go home. I'll see you guys when we get there. We are back home and we are gonna go through the haul. So the grand total was $497, so basically 500 bucks. Again, we got a lot of stuff. And just a small disclaimer, you feed your family what you want to feed your family. I'll feed my family what I would like to feed mine. And we will all remain happy. Because remember, that is best. All right, carrying on and let's jump into it. We are starting off at the table and we got the uh, special K. These are basically like a very thin, macro-friendly um, Pop-Tart. Sometimes I like to have these like as a pre-workout snack. Or sometimes I'll do the Rice Krispie Treat, kind of depends on like my mood. But the girls also like them for their lunch. They're really good. They are very light, but they're very, very tasty. So I picked those up. These are like 10 bucks. And we get our tortillas from there. These are our favorite. We got three packs of the El Milagro tortillas, corn tortillas. I've been substituting um, like either carb, like my carbs, like whatever it is, uh, pasta, potato, um, rice with tortillas lately. And I've been loving that. And I think they're like three, four dollars or something. I got some Mexican sour cream. This was only three dollars and like 71 cents, which is a really good deal. I'm making a dip. Stay tuned. If you guys are not subscribed, please subscribe. Um, I'm going to have some shorts coming up this weekend, probably starting on Friday with like dip options and dessert options and stuff like that. Not only for Super Bowl, but also if you have like kids and Galentine's and like Valentine's Day. So definitely stay tuned because I have some really good ones coming. So I picked that up. These are a favorite of Leo's. He loves these. These are the Premier Protein Protein Pancakes. These were, I think, 12 bucks. They were carrying them for a while, then they stopped and they brought them back, and he was so excited. The macros for three pancakes, 210, four fat, 27 carb, and 15 protein. He loves them, eats them for breakfast. Really easy thing. I got the four, are there four packs of cream cheese. Like I said, I have some recipes coming up. Um, I'm gonna do a dip. I think I'm gonna do like a veggie pizza, stuff like that. So I needed some cream cheese, and I've been paying out of my 
rear end for cream cheeses lately at the grocery store. So pick this up and I believe this was eight bucks or no, six dollars for four, which is a pretty good deal considering it's Philadelphia. Cherry mixed fruit cups. These were on uh, coupon this month and I believe these were nine dollars. Pick those up for the kids. Rice Krispie treats. These were seven dollars. Again, I eat these as a pre-workout and the kids also can have them for their lunches. And these are like seven dollars. I ended up getting, I put back that hot honey chicken and I got these breakfast sandwiches for my kids instead. Um, they love these, these are $11 and everybody loves them. I've never tried them, they smell really good, but everybody does enjoy them and they're just easy for the kids to have before school or you know, like when they get home or whatever the case may be. Um, I got a two pack of chicken Caesar salads. Rhea likes to bring these to work and if not Rhea, Sophia, they're $5 for two of them. Just something easy for them to take. I got the Belvita Crunchy, the blueberry ones. These were $12. Everybody likes them. They are really good. I enjoy them occasionally, but um, just for Leo to have. I like to throw these in his lunch bag. If he gets stuck in traffic and he's not home starving, he can snack on those. The kids bring them for their lunches. You know, just easy things. Uh, the girls requested Frosted Flakes, and I was A-OK -okay with that for cereal this month because it was on sale for 5 bucks. And I was like, heck yes. I didn't even check. Oh, actually, I can have this too because it has zero fat. So um, I have cereal every night. Um, so I get like, depending on the day, I get between like 30 and 40 grams of cereal a night. So I could have some of that as long as the fat's under 3 grams, which this is. OxyClean. I throw this in with my towels. I throw this in with the kids' clothes. If they, like, there's coats, I'm going to clean all their coats, my linens. You name it, I throw them in and it really keeps everything fresh and like my gym stuff, that's why I wash it with this. I love it, this was 12 bucks. This will last me probably like two-ish months, but um, 12 bucks for all this is a really good deal. I got Q-tips, I actually just ran out of them and you never know how much you need them until you don't have them. This was $7 for a three pack, not that bad. This will last us forever, honestly, probably for like a year, maybe even more, but picked those up. I got some crackers. The girls love crackers, just a snack on. They will eat these over chips any day. So I picked them up, they were on coupon for five bucks. I also got them some soups, which I'll show you right now. So I figured they could have soup and crackers on um, other days they're off of school or for you know a meal. I got some game. This was actually on sale for 15, which was the same price as the Sam's Club brand. So I picked that up. I love game. That's gain. I, I go in between. It depends on my mood, but I do love a good game. Gain and um Tide are usually my favorite, like the Tide plus Downy. It's my favorite. I got Leo a pair of jeans. These are the 505 regular ones. Um, these were 36 bucks. So I liked the color of these. And I bought him a couple different pairs of Levi's for Christmas. And he didn't like them. He didn't like the style. He didn't like, he said they were the relaxed fit. He thought they were too bag. It was just a whole thing. So I returned them and I was like, here, do you like these ones? Okay, I'll pick them up because his jeans, like you could see his cell phone print on some of his jeans. And I'm like, okay, those gotta go. Um, I got a case of Coke Zero, this was 17 bucks. I got the Downy Pebbles, these were $11. So they were actually on sale for 15, but if you have the scan and go, which I'm telling you guys to make sure you just take the time and do that, they were only 11. So I was like, heck yeah. I was gonna buy two, but I just bought one not too long ago. So I think I'm good. Um, I got this case of chicken noodle soup from Campbell's. This was $10 for 12 cans, which is a really good deal. And just the kids like it. It's one of those things that I could stay in the cupboard or in like the pantry and they could always pull out something. I got the thing of bagels. I have half of a bagel um, for first meal on some days. So I have those and the girls like having bagels as well. They've been doing like little pizza bagels and stuff like that. So these were five bucks. And then I got the two pack of Italian breads, my kids' favorites for their lunches, and this was also $5. You guys know I had to get the paper plates, styrofoam plates, whatever. Um, just it's easier, especially when we got company. These last forever, and I hate washing dishes. Honestly, there's five of us here, and you just stay, wa and I hate having dishes in the sink, so these were like 12 bucks. This was not on sale, but none of these were, but these are for the kids' lunches. Again, these are the things I keep. All the stuff I showed you for the kids' lunches, you know, all the snacks, they'll stay in my room and that's it. They're like on Leo's side of the bed. 
so they do not go in there and they last okay that is like the best secret i can give you guys especially if you have kids and you're like dang they are going through this stuff keep it out of their reach and i mean it's not aesthetically appeasing to have you know snacks in your room or whatever but you know what's aesthetically pleasing having money in my pocket so um 18 for freaking chips I could have just gotten them the crackers, but my nephew's coming over on the weekend and he likes when TV has a little little treats too. And then the girls are having their friends over. There's always, I have three daughters, 10, 14, 8, 19. And there's always a group of people in my house. You know, whether it's my oldest daughter and her friends are here or the middle, there's always kids here. And I love that. I love that this house is that house. You know, you got to remember, we live in an age where there's no there's no one's calling on the house phone. So when I see these people, I'm able to put like a face to the name. I'm able to like be in the mix, hear the things, be around it. So I try to keep snacks on board because you got food, they will come. You know, that's just another thing. I'm raising I'm raising three girls. We're preteen and teenagers. I like to know what is going on. So got those. I got some Chef Moirdi ravioli. They eat this. I mean, it's one of those things that'll probably last us for quite a few months. Um, but again, it's just something to have in the um, back closet or like our pantry. Um, it's one of those things, like I said, they you know they don't eat it like every day or something. These are like I said, it'll last us probably a few months. But again, it's something to have in there. So if they're at the moment where like I need to go to the store, but hey, and they're whining that they're starving, there's something back there. I got the white meat chicken nuggets from Tyson. This was five pounds and it was the same price. It was 13 bucks as that other one. So got that. These were on clearance. I picked these up for Leo. He was like refusing to even try these because of the zero sugar. This was $3. And I was like, look, I'm going to make these for you with some hot dogs and you're going to love them and you're not even going to know the difference. He just didn't even want to think about trying them because of the zero sugar, but it's fine. Okay. You want to be able to eat your things. You can make some minor adjustments. So picked that up. I have been completely out of peanut butter. I got the uh, Maker's Mark or Member's Mark uh, brand. This was eight bucks for two of them. I don't eat much peanut butter. I eat maybe like 10 grams, you know, a few times a week. Not much at all. Um, but when I need it, I need it. And uh, yeah, so I picked that up. But leave on the kids. They'll eat the peanut butter. Now over here, we got the prime rib beef steak sliders. These are really great. They're on the grill. The kids love them. Um, we serve them with Hawaiian bread and everybody loves them. They're really good and uh, come out really nicely. Um, we paid $14.19 for those. I got a thing, two pounds of strawberries. These were $4. I was looking at a lot of the fruit. A lot of it was expensive. Like a bag of cuties was like 10 bucks. I have a bunch of apples here from our local grocer having a sale. So um, we were all out of berries. And like I said, we have like um, apples and plums. I'm sorry, apples and pears. So I'm like, all right, well, whatever. We're not going to get the oranges. I got a thing of full skinless chicken thighs. This was... $13.71. I have one in the freezer already, so um, I, we should be okay. And I have a whole sleeve already prepped, so I should be good at least for the next couple weeks. Um, I got a thing of uh, eggs. This was like $4.98. Picked those up. Thing of frozen pizzas. Again, we have a lot of days off. And um, these things, like, are cheaper to buy in bulk than to pick them up at the grocery store. Again, my kids don't eat all of these in like a week or a month or something like that. These are just things that are in the freezer, that there is a selection, there's a variety. If their friends are over here, you know, that's the thing where I kind of struggle with. That's why I try to have a variety because um, for a while I was always ordering food for everybody and that kind of got expensive. So then um, I would cook for them and sometimes, you know, they come over random times, there's different people. Um, so instead of them like, you know, wanting to go out to get something at, you know, nine, 10 o'clock at night, the older ones or something along those lines, there's something in the freezer. So there's always something for anybody to grab to eat. The kids know, I try to keep like these like, um, frozen pizzas and like uh, chicken nuggets in the freezer in the basement by the bar. So then when their friends are over, they always hang out by the basement that they know they can go in there and be like, oh, okay. And they don't have to worry about coming upstairs or feeling weird looking through the fridge. They know that they can go in the freezer downstairs and there's always something for them to grab and snack on. I always like for everybody to feel welcomed. If they're hungry, they can eat. This is a safe place for everyone and that's the vibe. So I know a lot of people are gonna be like, that's a lot of junk food. You gotta remember, it's not just my kids, okay? I want everybody to eat and no one goes home hungry. So picked those up. These were on coupon for 10 bucks. 
I got this. I've been doing, instead of turkey bacon, I've been doing uncured um, the Canadian bacon because you get three pieces um, for more protein and a little less calories. And I just been enjoying it lately. So I got that. This was nine bucks, which is actually really good because the little half sleeve, like the ones that come just like this one row, row are $8 at the local grocery. So I've been paying a lot for that. So that's definitely why it was one of the things I was looking for. I got two different salad kits. This is a new one, Ultimate Cheddar Ranch Chop Kit. Again, the girls eat them for lunch. They eat them on size for dinner. I'm probably gonna make one of these from the side for dinner tonight. I actually make both because they all love them. My kids love salads. So um, we did Ultimate Cheddar Ranch and then Southwest Chop Salad, another one of your favorites. For Super Bowl, Leo picked these up. These are bacon wrapped jalapeno peppers, 1871. Um, they're really good. He throws them on the smoker, and I swear to you, when he puts them on the smoker, they're even hotter. But they're really good. I love jalapeno peppers. Um, I picked these up for Super Bowl to kind of go with everything. I think he said we're going to do ribs, jalapeno poppers. I don't know what else. I mean, fries. I forget. Whatever. Um, so I, we picked those up. Um, I think they were $7. Do you guys have checkers by you? Checkers used to be really famous here. They have them inside like Walmarts now. Not the same. Okay, not the same. But whatever. Um, I got a thing of bananas. That's was like $1.71. This was 20 bucks. But this will last us forever. It's just a two pack of foil, but it's like a good thick foil and it'll last forever again. Like it'll last us for months. We bought one right before Rhea's graduation party in the summer and we're barely running out. So we get our money's worth. We got a thing of ribs for Super Bowl. These are pork spear ribs, $22.87. I believe he's gonna smoke those. Oh, and then he's making chicken wings. So we have a pack in the freezer already, and then he got a second pack. We got these actually marked down for $13.15. So that is it. So lots of good food, good snacks, good times, good vibes, okay? If you guys are shopping at Sam's, what are you picking up? They had some, I'm telling you, those rugs were a really good sale. They have a lot of outdoor stuff, so check it out. They did have a lot of, like, food marked down. Like, I've seen, like, uh, stuffings marked down for, like, $3. Like, stuff that they're trying to clear out from seasonal. So definitely check your aisles, kind of take your time and kind of walk around and see what you can get. But now this is the worst time. I don't mind shopping. I don't mind paying. I hate putting everything away. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. If you are new here, please stick around and subscribe. Give these videos a thumbs up. I do uh, a grocery haul either from Sam's or Costco once a month. And then throughout the month, I usually do a full days of eating, um, random grocery hauls, vlogs, you name it. Love for you to stick around because we are well on our way to getting our plaque this year, baby. And if you've been rocking with me, already know we real friends and I love you. Thank you for vibing with me and sticking with me. What do you guys think of my, my I gotta show you guys my outfit. Hold on, pause. Cause I feel like I look like Brooke Shields. It's giving uptown girl, right? And these are like a straight leg and I'm wearing like an old school Reebok. This shirt, okay, I'll tell you where the shirt's from cause I don't know if you guys are gonna ask, but LOTD, this shirt is from H&M. It's kind of a, um, I wanted the one from Ralph Lauren. The shirt was 20, the Ralph Lauren one was 140. These jeans are from um, Target. I don't know what the Target brand is. Universal Thread, they're a 10. I would say they run a little big. Um, I probably could have sized down. Um, and they're just a straight leg. So, all right, I'm out of here. Thank you guys for watching and have a good day. Bye friends.